Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Classic CC lets you soft proof images before printing or exporting. Soft proofing describes the process of previewing a photo on screen to see how the photo will look when printed. Soft proofing also lets you optimize a photo for a particular output device like a specific printer. When you soft proof an image in Lightroom Classic CC, you can evaluate and adjust the photo before printing. This can help to reduce tonal and color shifts that cause poor printing results. To soft proof an image in Lightroom Classic CC, display the Develop module and select the photo. Next, check the Soft Proofing checkbox option within the toolbar. If you don't see the option appear in the toolbar, select Soft Proofing from the toolbar menu. When you select the Soft Proofing tool, the background of the image display turns white. However, if the zoom level is set to fill or larger, you may not see the background turn white. You can look for the Soft Preview label in the upper right corner of the image display area to confirm that the Soft Proofing tool is active. The Soft Proofing panel also expands at the right side of the screen. You can use the options in the Soft Proofing panel to determine if the current colors in the photo are in gamut or range for a particular display or output device. In the upper left corner of the panel, you'll see the Show Hide Monitor Gamut Warning icon. If you hover over the icon, the photo will display blue any part of the photo where the colors are outside of your display's color capabilities. You can click the icon to show or hide the blue overlay. In the upper right corner of the panel, you'll see the Show Hide Destination Gamut Warning icon. If you hover over this icon, colors in the photo that are outside of your printer's rendering capabilities will appear red. You can also click to show or hide the red color from the display. If you click to both show the monitor gamut warning and the destination gamut warning at the same time, you may also see areas of pink in the image preview. The pink areas represent colors that are out of gamut for both the monitor and the destination device. The soft proofing panel also provides a profile drop-down menu. The profile describes the mathematical description of a device's color space. By default, the Develop module displays images using your computer monitor's profile. However, you can simulate a different output color space by selecting a different option from the Profile menu in the Soft Proofing panel. Under the Profile menu, you'll also see the Intent option. This setting determines how colors are converted between color spaces. You can choose either Perceptual or Relative for this option. If you choose Perceptual, the color conversion works to preserve the visual relationship between colors. This helps the colors to be perceived more naturally by the human eye even though color values may be adjusted. The Perceptual option is usually a good choice for photos that have a lot of out-of-gamut colors or highly saturated colors. If you select Relative, the color conversion compares the extreme highlight of the source color space to that of the destination color space and then adjusts all colors accordingly relative to the differences between the two extreme highlights. When you choose this option, out-of-gamut colors are just to become the closest reproducible colors in the destination color space. The relative option is usually a good choice for photos that do not have a lot of out-of-gamut colors because the option preserves more of the original colors in the photo than the perceptual option does. You'll also notice the Simulate Paper and Ink checkbox option. Although this option is not available for all profiles, it can help you predict what your image will look like when printed. When checked, this option simulates the dingy white of real paper as well as the dark gray color of black ink. When using the Simulate Paper and Ink feature, be sure to hide the Monitor Gamut Warning and the Destination Gamut Warning. If either warning feature is visible, the simulation image may not render properly on screen. To adjust your photo to bring it within a desired color space, Click the Create Proof Copy button within the Soft Proofing panel. Lightroom Classic CC creates a virtual copy that can be adjusted for printing. If you begin to adjust a photo without clicking the Create Proof Copy button, a pop-up message appears. To preserve your original image and make adjustments to a copy image, click the Create Proof Copy option within the pop-up message box. If you click Make This a Proof, you will go on to edit the original image. Of course, all editing in Lightroom Classic CC is non-destructive. That means that even if you select Make This a Proof and edit the original image, you can still undo those changes later. Like what you see? 
pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.